Hello everyone, I'm back. It's me, Master Abbott Man. Welcome to my channel. Where we talk about uh, my fanfiction, basically, because I am such a weirdo. We're gonna talk about my brother's um, work. Um, we're gonna talk about the other world paradox, Alpha Centaurians. Alright, so Alpha Centaurians. They are a group of uh, various races of humans and animals found in Alpha Centauri system that were mutated by this race uh, called the Picarians. The Alpha Centauri system closest star system to Earth. So basically there are several dwarf planets and asteroids living and moons living in this cluster that is basically a huge empire. The dwarf planets here by the way are like completely completely um what do you call this fiction. Yeah, they exist in the universe 777, the same universe where Miguel Ibarra comes from, if you actually know about Miguel Ibarra. Uh, first race, builders, super soldiers, live in the overworld of Verona, planet of the Alpha Centauri system. They're the Minecraft builders. Yeah. Okay, so Steve belongs to this race. They were originally like these, um, what were they originally? Oh yeah, they were um, engineers and terraformers. And then there's the villagers. The villagers are like these merchants. They have big noses and they cannot build. Some have become barbarians over time. And yeah, that is, that's what they are. They're just merchants. They were designed to be merchants, and now you're beginning to wonder why were they designed to become like these things. So, piglins. They are also merchants, but they also have a double purpose, to mine and to fight. Endermen? Okay, Endermen, there's this whole lore about them coming from Matt Pat's video, and he's an amazing YouTuber. Sure, he's retired, but I love him. I love him. Dude. Um, that that lore is included in this fan fiction. I'm, yeah, I love. That's how much I love his theories. Basically, the Enderman are they were formerly builders, Highlands, elf-like humans. Uh, the their purpose is what is their purpose exactly? Yeah, they were spies. Chica, their purpose was to invent, to build. They're engineers. Gerudo, their purpose was to also... They're, they're a different class of warrior, but they were mostly healer. Gorons, uh, heavy duty warrior. Zora, uh, water based warrior, marine warriors. Rito, aerial warriors. Koroks, uh, they are a loving race of tree folk, heavily and genetically modified by Picarians. Um, their purpose is very unclear <laughs> so far, but we I've been thinking that they should become like these. Um, they were supposed to be fruit people, like that's where you harvest food from. So, if it isn't obvious yet, basically. The humans were kidnapped from Earth, brought to the Alpha Centauri system, or the Nintendo Galaxy. Nintendo! I love Nintendo Galaxy. But I don't like it. But, uh, opinions for later. But basically, these, um, these humans eventually became, like, slaves. They have a caste system, and the highest are not humans at all. They're not from Earth. They're basically these... Aliens called the Picarians, and we've met them in my um my YouTube posts. My my is it called an AU? I don't know. I don't know what it's called. They're just it's just fan fiction, and I've placed it here in YouTube. You can also see it in the archive of our own for the complete set. Wattpad for the complete set. The more canon though is archive of our own. 
compared to the Wattpad. But in Wattpad, there are a lot of mistakes there. They're mostly just drafts, and then when they reach AO3, they become complete. And then there are, I just checked again, um, the brothers, of course, the brothers. They are, they have cartoonish bodies, they are humans spliced with, um, mushrooms. Mushrooms. They, they were placed in the turtle clan. Shrewmans, donkers, and toads. Basically, their headwear are usually made of mushrooms, but for the shrewmans, they don't have headwear. Instead, they have like hair that's fungi-like. Peach is apparently a shrewman. Donkers are basically, they all have hats on, no matter what. Toads, they have silly little truffle hats. Yeah, and those guys are like the brothers. They are called brothers because they have a brotherly attitude towards each other. That is their culture. And they are the central race in the whole series. And we all know Mario and Luigi are like brothers. And they are also like these, um, how do you call this? They are, they include the plumbers, which are not the plumbers from Ben 10 or the one that fixes your sink every now and then. They are the plumbers who are like barbaric warriors from plums, who are like very violent, very dangerous, very, very deadly. They have invented this pipe system, which allows them to travel around the galaxy. And that, that is what the plumbers are. Terrarians. They're like lower class builders. They're incredibly powerful though. They were... They're not, no, they're... Builders are the lower class. They are the replacements of the builders actually. They are more advanced. They're very known for creating architecture. They are terraformers. Very, very deadly. Most of the Joja Corp has a population of 10 million. Do you want to hear my brother? Yes. Okay. Okay, Stardew Valley has a population of around 1 billion. You should check it out. Oh, yeah, hold on. Pokemans. Pokey people. They live in the planet of Pokey per po Pokey world and yeah, Pokey people. They haven't been touched on yet. They were given the ranks of commanders in Plutarian Army, just explaining why the Team Rocket exists and the other teams in. The Pokemon world. They are very intelligent and they are very they are, they are known to command a lot. Wait lang. Wait. That's the food. <laughs> um I'll show you the food. Wait. Here it's the food. <laughs> it's pretty good. Um it's basically pizza and there's this um uh, mashed potato. Yeah, yeah, that's my brother. And that's um garlic bread pretty good that i won't show you the your face girl cage sorry i know don't worry i can tell okay uh and okay moving on to the race of non-human origin mobian hedgehogs okay you all know the hedgehogs, they are fast. Some of them have different chaos abilities, it just depends on the hedgehog. Foxes, and then Space Echidnas, Space Owls, Koopa. Space Echidnas are strong. Space Owls, they are deadly, dragon like creatures. Koopas, mm -hmm. the turtle dudes from season 1, way back when. Shiverian penguins, Shiverian seals. Basically, they were kidnapped, these humans and animals, to serve one purpose only, and that is to serve the Piperian race. Now, what are the Piperians? The Piperians are basically these shape-shifting speedsters from the planet Paperos. They should be called Paperians, but I kind of like Piperians better, and it makes them sound like paper. Because... The reason why they're called Paperians is because they are like paper. It's like when they shapeshift, you draw on them, you change their form, and they're quick to move because um, 
they're so light. They're that light. Their bodies are actually made of light itself. And they are so light that they are ma- able to move the speed of light. Got it? <laughs> and even faster. That's why they're so terrifying in the series. But I think... Uh, I think it wasn't... Ludwig's uh, introduction wasn't as good as Miguel's or Felix's. The shadows. But... I'll flesh him out later on. Just, just be patient, guys. Just be patient. But, yeah, that's it. That's yeah, all the Alpha Centaurians. Is important. Yeah, Ludwig is important, guys. Cage said, him, said it himself. Just, just wait. Just be patient. Alright? Alright. If you want a spoiler, I will spoil. Don't spoil, dude. I told you not to spoil. Come on. That's just, that's like, that's like the ultimate bad thing to do when it comes to my writing or any show you can't spoil dude blood all right all right that's it you can't spoil blood and blood. i will put on i will put a spoiler alert okay don't, don't, spoil, don't, don't spoil don't spoil don't spoil seriously i worked hard on the draft okay 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 yeah i know in, in another video i